The Goshen College women's soccer team hosted Indiana Tech in a go for the goal game. They made switch from their traditional purple kits to yellow to represent pediatric cancer. Junior four Kayla Shaw spoke about why spreading awareness is important. Um, I think representing the pediatric cancer as a Goshen College student means a lot because me and a lot of the team members have had a lot of family members who have been affected by cancer and so I think giving back to the community the people who are struggling and let alone the kids letting them know they're not struggling on their own and we're here helping them fight their battles with them I think it just brings a lot of awareness and it it makes us feel good about bringing the awareness. GC assistant Juliana Chop shares both player and coaching experiences on the pitch. I've been here as a player and coming back and having the opportunity to be here as a coach is it's very special for me because I know what the feeling is. I know what it's like to win games like this in, in a big crowd. Playing here, I don't remember seeing a crowd like that. And making those big events, it's very important for us so we can bring the community. And the community seeing that we're thinking about others and trying to help others with this fundraiser, which is very important for us to knowing that a lot of our players and knowing families having been there with cancer and just to let them know that they're not alone, that we're here to support them and to help provide for them. I think it's very important for us as, as a team. The crossbar challenge was a part of the donation project as students paid to take a shot at the crossbar and the Maple Leafs also provided free root beer to the fans to draw more awareness. Um, bringing the free root beer to the game, we were just trying to get more of a big crowd. The bigger the crowd, the more awareness we can spread to the people here for, about pediatric cancer and raise awareness for them. So our goal is to raise a thousand. Last year was 500 and we got it. And this year is a thousand and I haven't looked it up where it is now, but I think we will be pretty close. Maple Leafs also defend a home pitch for the overtime victory to cap off the night. Um, it felt great. It feels great to win on a big night like this when there's a big crowd like there was tonight. It feels great and it's the it's what we were expecting. The next game for the Maple Leafs will be on the road versus rival Bethel University. For Glow Sports, I'm Benjamin Cotton.